you're trying to get your ex back, there is one thing you need to do first, and that's to get you back. In the next 30 seconds, I'm going to make your life a lot more simple, a lot more clear. It's not complicated. When you feel great, you speak great. When you feel great, you make different decisions. When you feel great, you become the kind of person people want to be and the kind of person people want to be around. But feeling great ain't a concept. It's not an idea. It's a skill. Even more accurately put, it's a conditioning. When you feel great, that is the crux, the fuel, the foundation to make everything come true. That is what shifts the, your relationships in your, in your favor. But again, feeling great is a skill. It's a conditioning. Well, the only reasons why people go many years or decades without even addressing the core is very simple. Most people confuse times in their life where things are going their way. The real question is, can you still feel good when things are not going your way? Because the truth is, when your emotions get the better of you, that's exactly when you say and do things you should not be saying or doing. Contrary to popular belief, sometimes the grass is greener on the other side. So if you really want to change that the trajectory of your relationship and really rebuild it from rebuild it from the ashes, you first have to get you back. People respond in accordance with the version of you you bring to the table. If you get yourself feeling good, you'll start speaking differently, making different decisions, and you'll actually become the kind of person that people want to fight for. Super simple. Address the emotional core, your relationships, and your life will turn around.